hi good morning welcome to number two of my Athala reading um, I just wanted to show you the top cover of the deck um, the top plate and this is what the deck looks like it's actually quite small um, I, I did it bigger and then I decided I was going to try doing it a uh, tiny sort of palm held you have to excuse my fingers I've been painting and they're pretty grotty anyway um, I've got the flash on because for some reason the exposure has gone crazy but today's reading uh, it's the 3rd of May and I did try and do a few others in the interim but for some reason my phone wouldn't let me record it so I figured that was a bit of a sign saying take it slow so the first card of the day um, this one is it's kind of like everything's getting in balance but there are still little bits and chunks that need to be sorted out um, before the flow is fully uh, fully engaged so as you can see the little black bits are they're separating um, and they're about to be released into the bloodstream but they're not quite not quite detached enough yet so we're, we're, we're getting there but there's a bit of work <coughs> in progress um, and this one this one is um, it's uh, the Maitreya Buddha um, but uh, the Maitreya Buddha is is usually an empty kind of shape and this one is filled with color um, so it's almost like in the in the Maitreya uh, concept I guess it's uh, it's the expectation of of um, a quintessential opening space uh, which is which is white so it's the reverse and this one is is filled with color um, I painted it quite intuitively and it, it's almost like, you know, we have a blank canvas to put whatever we choose onto it in a creative way uh, from the, 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 the Dantian, from that kind of space in our knowing of, of who we are and how we fulfill our own pathway, I guess, or joys. Um, sorry, I haven't had enough coffee yet today. <laughs> uh, number three, this is um, this is the Axis Mundi card. If you look at it this way, it's it's the you know the, the elements, the waters, the the land, the trees, and the sky. But also, it works like this as kind of a stairway between. The heaven and the earth um, or Jacob's Ladder there's lots of different mythologies um, yeah this one kind of showed up in a drawing when we were snowed in one weekend and, and uh, oops losing the light <laughs> okay and this one gotta hurry up I love this one this is just it's like a boom boom a channel of gold coming into a vortex so it's just like inspiration a bolt of lightning being connected so um, for me these times are kind of you know about what is what is our connection what's our connection to ourself and what's our connection to source and what kind of you know quote unquote work do we need to do to sort of harmonize all the different colors of our existence and make choices and release and you know live in this kind of divine inspiration anyway that's today <laughs> cheers thanks for listening <laughs>